Um, a week after St. John's County's fire chief left his post, we are learning new information about what led up to his sudden resignation. And was it really voluntary? I went through documents and reports to get a better understanding of the decisions your leaders are making. Here's what I learned. Scott Bullard, a 21-year veteran of the St. John's County Fire Department. He received an award for his work in 2013. This year, he was St. John's County's fire chief for less than five months. He was hired in May, and at an October 3rd County Commission meeting, a commissioner asked the county administrator. Uh, has uh, Mr. or Captain Bullard resigned formally? Chief Bowler tendered his verbal resignation yesterday. First Coast News has obtained a copy of Bullard's voluntary resignation form, dated that same day, October 3rd. The next day, October 4th, he wrote a letter saying his resignation was, quote, recommended by the county administration. He added that he was forced to resign from this position, having done nothing to cause detriment to the fire department or the county. First Coast News obtained Bullard's personnel file. It includes an August letter from the St. John's County Firefighters Union citing serious safety concerns for our firefighters and Chief Bullard's actions make us question his ability to lead this department competently, safely, and with integrity. The union says Bullard switched the standard uniform to one that was 65% polyester uniform, something the union points out OSHA rules do not support. The union had supported 100% cotton t-shirts and button-ups because it said they were found to be the safest. The file also includes concerns that Bullard unilaterally ended the use of vacation time for an employee who ran out of sick leave, saying they would instead be placed on leave without pay. The county administrator said that decision was in direct conflict with county policy and told Bullard it needed to be rescinded immediately. Weeks later, Bullard resigned. We are fostering a culture of inclusiveness and culture of supporting of our team. The county attorney quickly interjected and asked the commission and the administrator to hush. Um, It'd be my request to you all to try to wrap up conversation on, on this um, as it's a personnel issue. Okay, so there is more in that personnel file we received this afternoon, and we are still going through it. We have tried to reach out to Mr. Bullard to see if he would like to share his story with us. And uh, Mr. Bullard, if you're watching, please reach out to us. We'd like to know more from you.